So rumor has it Toronto is about to become metropolis. Seems we are better, su better suited for Superman than our friends out west. That tops this edition of Entertainment City. Lindsay Lohan is soaking up her first full day of freedom. The actress completed her court-ordered treatment at a Malibu rehab clinic yesterday. According to reports, the troubled star plans to head to New York to get away from the L.A. party scene, but not before making a brief pit stop at a sober living house. The Canyon star is reportedly determined to make sobriety stick this time around, and we wish her well, but we'll believe it when we see it. You're a piece of shit. You don't deserve to breathe the same air I do. Who is a piece of shit? You are Kristen Stewart is showing once again her disgust for the paparazzi. In this YouTube video, the star is heard freaking out on a photographer from behind a gate. Are you and Robert back together? Not clear what sparked the blow up, but the harsh words didn't stop the guy behind the lens from questioning the actress about her split with Robert Pattinson. No surprise, the celeb hopped into a waiting car without giving him the scoop. And while Stewart isn't talking about her ex, Katy Perry is dishing about the Twilight breakup. The brunette beauty gracing the cover of September's L.U.K. While the singer looks fierce in Dolce & Gabbana, another story is told inside the mag. The California girl cleared the air on her friendship with Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson after the pop star was spotted getting cozy with Stewart's ex back in May, fueling relationship rumors. Not the case, according to Perry. She claims she was just trying to be a friend to the Twilight actor. In fact, she tells Elle she would never disrespect Stewart like that, and even went as far as to text the actress to make sure she knew there was no love connection. Perry is also clearing the air with a new fragrance. Killer Queen is the singer's soon-to-be-released new perfume. And this promo video gives fans a taste of what they can expect from Perry's third fragrance. As for the regal title, the songstress says she was inspired by the Queen song of the same name. How did you like filming in Canada? I'm from Toronto. I really like filming in Canada. Yeah? Yeah, really nice up there. Rumors are flying faster than a speeding bullet that Toronto could soon be superhero central. There are reports the production of Man of Steel 2, featuring Superman and Batman together for the first time, is being relocated from Vancouver to Toronto. So what's behind the possible change-up? The tax man. No, he's not a new arch nemesis in the franchise. Apparently, tax credits in Ontario are more enticing for the Man of Steel movie makers than what's now being offered in BC, where the first blockbuster flick in the series was filmed. Man of Steel 2 is slated for release in 2015. Ryan Gosling fans want to see more of the hunky actor, lots more. The Canadian heartthrob has taken the top spot in a racy news survey, ranking the stars we would most like to see take it all off in a sex tape. Gosling beat out stiff competition from Channing Tatum and Brad Pitt in the steamy poll from xcritic.com and adult movie maker Vivid Entertainment. As for the famous couple that fans would like to see between the sheets, that title goes to newlyweds Justin Timberlake and Jessica Biel. Entertainment City, brought to you by Fallsview Casino Resort in Niagara Falls, the place you want to be.